I am a proud daughter of an immigrant, and there are millions more like me. In fact, this great nation of ours was built on immigration. The service of my ancestors, the Afghan Cameleers, allowed us to navigate the plains of this land. They were pioneers, and I too will be a pioneer and walk in their footsteps to serve our nation as they did. As a nation, we have the potential, we have the drive, and we definitely have the appetite to support, grow, and nurture the future leaders to come. So let us quit the bigotry racism and discrimination. Australia is way beyond that. Let us not settle on multiculturalism being just a brand we associate with or take pride in as a nation, but rather fully embrace it by caring for one another, by accepting each other for who we are and what we can become, and by ensuring all voices are heard at the table. It is time to love, care and respect one another. It is time to unite, not break away and divide. It is time to use our diversity as our strength and seek wisdom in our differences. Because we all know beneath it all, we all belong to the human race. I'll finish by sharing the poem by Saadi Sherazi called Bani Adam, which translates to Children of Adam, a truly timeless piece that my late father would always recite to me in diary. Bani Adam az hai yak digaran ke dar aferinish se yak gauharan cho ozve badard awarad rozgar digar ozha ra namanad qarar tu ke az mehnat digaran be ghami na shayad ke namat nahand adami which translates to human beings are members of a whole in creation of one essence and soul. If one member is afflicted with pain, other members uneasy will remain. If you have no sympathy for human pain, the name of human you cannot retain. I thank the Senate.